Yo, what's going on, Jesters? Welcome back to another video. Tonight is gonna be a different type of video simply because last night I had one of the craziest nights of my life and I wasn't even able to finish my video, guys. That's how bad it was. You guys know it's bad when I, myself, can't even finish my video. So basically what I'm gonna be doing in today's video is I'm gonna be reviewing last night and I also thought why not take the opportunity to review some of the scariest moments on my channel yet. So basically what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be pulling up four of the scariest moments on all of my videos in total, including last night, which was the scariest experience of all time, guys. I wasn't even able to sleep in my room last night. I literally left my house and didn't even come back. I didn't come back until the morning. My room is literally set the exact same way as before. The only thing I did was literally change, and that's it, guys. I dipped, I did not come back. It was absolutely insane, but I know you guys are gonna love this video because you guys love this scary stuff, and I know you guys do. So before I get started into that, guys, please drop a like down below, guys. Let's hit 5,000 likes on this video. I know we can do it. You guys killed it on yesterday's video. We almost already at 8,000 likes, meaning I have to do a part two to Chucky, which I am not looking forward to, but I know for a fact that you guys really wanna see it, so I will be doing it for you guys. If you're new to my channel, you guys have not yet subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Join the Jesters, join our family. We are on the road to 300K Jesters. We are growing incredibly fast, guys. It is so crazy to believe. So, if you guys wanna help the journey, subscribe, press that subscribe button. Also, guys, so many of you have been waiting for this. Drum roll, please, you ready? I have opened a P.O. box. The details for those in the description box for like the rest of my life. So guys, if you guys wanna send me anything, any sort of fan mail, letters, drawings, anything guys, anything you guys wanna send me, go ahead and do that. I'll be checking my P.O. box like around once a week, so I'll always have something to show on the videos. And if it gets really, really out of hand, which will be really cool if you guys actually sent me a bunch of stuff, I'll be making separate videos for those and I'll be doing some of the craziest ideas possible while opening the fan mail, which would be absolutely amazing. So guys, send me stuff, the links in the description box. That is the address you guys have to send things to. So there is my P.O. box. A lot of you guys have been waiting for it and I'm super excited to have finally announced it. Before getting into the video, guys, please check out my Instagram right there on the screen. Go leave a like, follow, and comment for the Instagram shout out. Today's Instagram shout out goes to these people. All right, shout outs to everybody who's commenting. So crazy, look at all the spam. So guys, the more you spam, the higher chance you have at being in the video. Like look at this, the entire page dedicated to these people because they spam so, so much. Shout outs to you guys. Sorry I can't read your name because I'm looking at it on the screen and it's like backwards. But massive shout out to you guys. You guys are amazing. Look at all the love, holy crap. All right, there you have it, guys. That is today's Instagram shout out. If you guys want your chance, as I said before, go follow my Instagram, like my pictures, and then spam comment my most recent picture for your chance to be on tomorrow's Instagram shout out. And without further ado, guys, let's start this video. Alrighty, guys, so I just picked out the videos. There is four scares in total, and one being the one from last night. I'm gonna be going from less scary to the scariest at the end. And let's start off, guys. Let's just do it right away. So the first one, I'll be putting it on the screen right here. There you go. So the first one, they'll be on the screen right there. Basically what happened in this video, okay? So I'm gonna rewatch it as I'm explaining. I played the Midnight Man challenge, and if you guys haven't seen what that is, it was probably one of the craziest challenges there is. And I did it in the gym at Laws of Motion, and it was absolutely insane, guys. So basically me and Moosey, we were roaming around doing the Midnight Man challenge, and then we couldn't find anything. We were hearing noises the entire night, and then this happened right here. It's the door. Look at the door. Look at the door. It's going by itself. What the Guys, fuck? Yo, stop! The Leave us alone! The door was literally opening and closing, and then there was literally, if you can look close enough, there is legit a shadow there opening and closing the door. I have no idea what the hell happened. I know for a fact it was just me and Moosey in the gym the entire night, so nobody could have been in here. We locked the gym and everything. So we are pretty sure the Midnight Man was literally right in front of us and we couldn't even realize because we were so terrified. It was absolutely insane guys. Do not ever try the Midnight Man challenge unless you were prepared. We were not prepared guys. We didn't even finish the challenge. We just booked it out of the gym because we didn't have the holy water or whatever it was to finish the actual map, mm. to finish the actual challenge. We just left the gym which was not a good thing because I ended up going back and it was just equally as bad. So moving on from that, the second scare guys, oh my god, this one was very recent and you guys know how terrifying it was. I run a week ago, week and a half ago, my friend Kenrick 
was taken by Zozo and I went back to the gym to look for him and I started slowly finding pieces of his clothing which is very strange and then eventually I found most of his clothing and then he appeared guys but the way he appeared guys was the most terrifying thing I have legitimately ever seen and so many of you guys agreed it was one of the craziest things ever I'll be playing that right there you guys got his necklace no freaking way guys holy shit what the fuck no 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 guys, no, no, no it was so no, freaking no, no. bad I'm telling you right now I literally couldn't even sleep that night that's how terrifying it was it was so freaking scary Oh my god, it's literally I'm trembling like thinking about it. It was ridiculous. Thankfully, I did save him afterwards and everything went well, but it just goes to show how crazy Zozo can be if he possesses somebody. And that's scaring me because I do Zozo videos all the time and I'm, I'm surprised guys. I'm so surprised that nothing has happened to me yet and I'm so thankful for it. But guys, moving on from that is the third one, which was also very, very recent. All these scary things happen to happen when Zozo is around. And you guys probably seen it because it was just a couple days ago. Basically, I went to go save my friend Moosey after he got captured from Zozo's assistant. If you guys have seen that video, Moosey, there, there's going to be cards throughout the entire video to watch those videos if you guys haven't seen them. Basically, what happened is I was running after him, looking for Moosey, and then after a couple minutes of searching for him, he was ended up on the train tracks, and as I was like, I heard some screams, help, 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 and I went to go help him, and basically, all I hear is like, He's here. He's here. I'm like, what do you mean? And I as I bring the camera up guys The Zozo black shadow Assistant thing. I don't even know guys. I don't even know what the hell it was I freaked out a little bit and when I turned back to James it was gone like it disappeared just out of that That was so scary like his neck did like a full like 180 guys like to the back of his spot Like I don't even know what the hell happened there. It was so freaking bad. It was so scary After that guys, I was like, okay no more Zozo for a little bit and I took a few days off of doing it and then that's what bringing me to tonight so 10 or that's what brings me to last night which was when I decided to do another Zozo video which was my mistake apparently that was definitely my mistake and not only did I just do a simple Zozo video by searching for him I used the Ouija board and I know so many of you guys right now are like cringing you're like no why would you use the Ouija board to summon Zozo Guys, I didn't try to summon Zozo. I tried to just summon like a demon in normal, and then this happened. No, 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 no. <sighs> Guys, I still have no idea how to explain it. Yo, guys, I literally left my room, my house, for eight hours, 10 hours, whatever time it is now. It scared the sh out of me. And I thought it was still in my room when I was even got into my house. Like I was like opening my door slowly, whatever the hell that was guys. I really hope it's gone. Like I really, really hope it's gone. But honestly, he here's a replay. Literally people want to see it again. It was so messed up. Whoever is in this room with me, whichever demon it is, Please show yourself and tell me your name. Zed? No. Guys. You guys, what the f- No. No. What the fuck? No, 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 no. No, no. What the heck was that, guys? If you have any idea of what that was, please drop it in the comments down below. I really, really, really want to know. That was absolutely insane. But guys, that was the video, probably a quick video for you guys, just a recap on what happened last night and in my video in general. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like down below. As I said before, we're aiming for 5,000 likes on this video. I know we can do it. Subscribe and join the Jesters if you're new to this channel. If you guys want to send me anything 
at all, go to my P.O. Box. The P.O. Box details are on the screen and will be in the description box down below. Go and do that. That would be absolutely amazing. Today's post notification shout out goes to these amazing people. Thank you guys so much for supporting me and staying active on my social medias and YouTube. Please go ahead and add my Snapchat. It is on the screen right there. I will be adding a couple of you guys back and answering as many Snapchats as I possibly can. So go ahead and do that. And until tomorrow's video, guys, Jester's out.